Welcome back to OpenFirePitCooking.com. This is Benjamin, and today we're going to be cooking up something I did not enjoy growing up, but I enjoy now, which is uh, Brussels sprouts. So, um, growing up, I, Brussels sprouts were real soggy. They were just didn't have any flavor. Um, wasn't something I really enjoyed, but growing up, it's a very good complement to pork, and today we're cooking up some pork in another video. So I'm going to make a, a complement to that, which is Brussels sprouts. So it's very easy. Um, just heat up your uh, cast iron pan, throw some butter in it. And then just open these up. So we're not going to be boiling them. We're just going to be throwing them in there frozen actually and just let them cook slowly. And then I like to season them with just some McCormick vegetable seasoning. Just all up in there. Some uh, onion powder. And just some pepper. Give it a little, little kick, a little flavor. And I'm just gonna let that sit in the Dutch oven on a warm part of the grill and turn them every so often. So I'm gonna grab my lid. Spatula. I'm just gonna just let them go in there, toss them around a little bit. Basically, just let them go. So we'll be back a little later. Thank you for stopping by. Okay, we're back with OpenFirePitCooking.com, and we're gonna check on our Brussels sprouts. So I've had them off in the corner for about an hour. I'm gonna take a look at them. I'm gonna toss them. So the only thing I had these in here with was butter. I don't like them soggy. I like them crispy and brown. So these look like they're doing really good. So just gonna toss them real quick. And cover them back up and I'll be right back when we plate them up. Welcome back to OpenFirePayCooking.com. And uh, our Brussels should be ready about now so I'm gonna just open them up and check on them the thing about Brussels sprouts that I don't like is if you like boil them in water and they get all soggy so these ones we just threw some butter in there some seasonings and slow cooked them browned the outsides they should be good to go look at that So these are a great complement to pork. Anytime I do any pork dish, I, I side, Brussels are one of my sides now. So I love them as an adult and cooking them this way, even your kids will eat them. Again, my, my tongue can't do these hot things, but I'm gonna try one of these out. Mm. So I love the crunch. There's still a crunch on the inside. Uh, the butter has an amazing flavor. Mm. That's gonna taste amazing with tonight's pork chops. So thank you for stopping by. I hope you subscribe.